Welcome, armchair generals, weekend warriors, and Saturday soldiers alike to the land of technical difficulties. Um, so just uh, before I begin my usual waffling, uh, I just encountered, uh, and in all honesty, and I might contact the creators about this, about the mod, the creators of the mod about this, but uh, there are times when the game locks up, doesn't freeze, you don't get that grey screen, programmers stop responding, it's just takes a really long time to continue processing. Um, I'm hoping that by restarting the game it's fixed it, but I have no idea. But I will contact them about it uh, later. <sighs> but it doesn't look like it's fixed. Shit. Oh well, at least I'll have video proof to point them to. So. <clears throat> When last we left off, I'd made ludicrous amounts of money uh, hacking into a bank account, and I had displayed my ludicrous hubris. So, again, it probably wouldn't have happened if I had have transferred the money to my uplink account, but it just feels more proper. Just feels a bit more proper. Um, to transfer it all to, you know, to sock puppet accounts, basically. Now, uh, I'm going to do some of that back hacking that I promised last time. Um, just, you know, see who went where and trying to figure out who, who was what. So, uh, I will show you, this is Alexandru O'Sullivan. So this is, uh, one of the first logs that I wrote down. Don't remember where I found it, but this is who it is. Now, can't do anything. What's up with that? So, might actually might just indulge my paranoia for a second and erase that log. Um, so I'm basically just going to be spending this episode kind of dicking around, um, waiting for the new hardware I ordered to be installed, and at the end of the episode I'm going to hack into uh, the Uplink internal services the uplink internal services system and uh, just give you guys a rough idea of what to expect um the rig I'm going to get has room for eight uh, CPUs um and I'm going to get eight 200 gigahertz CPUs so that's 1600 gigahertz of processing like Everything I do will be at lightning speed. So while I'm waiting for that, like I said, just going to dick around. Now, if I had, if only I had the monitor bypass. If only I had have gotten that instead. Um, if, I, if only I had gotten that instead. Because here's the thing: if I bypass this monitor and I hack in here, I get no active trace, so I can just spend all the time in the world. Just dicking around. Alexandru Sullivan. If anyone knows what what, but sadly this doesn't give me any information either. What I want to know is just again, just basically who does he work for? Uh, if I wanted to. And more to the point, if I had the room in my files, uh, I could bounce around all of the banks looking for his bank account. Again. Uh. This game allows you to indulge in a capacity to be evil that is frankly scary. Like, you... You couldn't be this evil in real life. You shouldn't be this evil in real life. I mean, I say you couldn't, but... I know that there's enough people out there that are evil in, in, in this capacity, but... Um... Like... I've, I've become more aware of this in my old age. Um... Much more aware of this. But previously when I was younger I'd be like, oh cool, it's a hacking game, but but as I've had to adult more, you know, this kind of wanton 
malicious, not even malicious, just casual destruction of a person's life is scary. I mean, I'll indulge in it because it's a video game with no consequences, but I, yeah, encourage people not to be this heartlessly evil in real life. Don't be me, basically. So yeah, also you'll find that um, sometimes I have programs like the Decipher here running literally as fast as it can and still be in the red because 60 gigahertz processor is just not enough to completely run this at its maximum power. So, be dealing with that, but... Yeah. This is, this is a lot better than um, the elliptic curve encryption cipher in the base game. It's um, just it basically, it's just a grid of squares that you gradually fill in. <sighs> Christ's sake. Um, I actually prefer the spinning dial and the randomized numbers at the bottom. I think that's a much nicer aesthetic. Uh, this, this mod, again, this mod gives you a few quality of life improvements, but it doesn't actually, it's, it's not a, a mod, it's not an overhaul. It's r remarkably little actually changes. And I, uh, I actually appreciate that. I appreciate that they didn't try and shoot the moon and make the most revolutionary thing possible. They they kept everything in the game that still makes it uplink, but they've just modernized it. They've made it play easier. They've made it look beautiful. And you've got to respect the work they put into this. You've also got to respect the, the work they put into making this stay the same this is still the same game the bells and whistles might be a little different but it's it's yeah I, I don't know how to describe it other than that it's still it's it's the same game they've just made it run smoother but it's still uplink and I appreciate that it's good I swear to God, if that ends up being a H, I will be very surprised. I didn't see what it was, but I can only hope it was an H. Right. So, uh, yeah. Oh, by the way, you can convict people. You can you can add random. Um, criminal charges against them. Oh, it's not going to let me write fraternizing with the enemy. Whatever. I'm bugging out. So yeah, so uh, that was the first IP address that I got. That was I, at the end of the, at the end of the LP. I'll be I'll be sharing my thoughts about the game and 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 uh, where I, again. This is not so much on the mod team. This is on the original creators. What they could have done that is just simply. Where, what else they could have done with it, um, other avenues they could have taken, other things you could do, especially now if they remade this in the modern time. So I'm probably getting nothing out of that, so it was fun. Let's just strike that from my record. Oh, I've also got to get back into the Global Criminal Database later and have a look at something. Holy shit, I can't read my own fucking handwriting. That's, that third number is either a 9 or a 7. It's a 7. And 
And like I said, the, these IP addresses, they very rarely have anything to do with anything. But it's fun. If I could figure out who these people were, if I could figure out if either of them were an uplink agent, that would be fascinating. But that's going to be another dead end. No, no, IP address, you dickhead. Now again, I'm probably playing the game very inefficiently. You know, you should have everything set. Uh, and you should just you shouldn't have to go to here, huh? Oh, fuck that up then. Um, but how to describe this? Yeah, sci fetish. Whoops. Um. Yeah, it's, it's just interesting to see what they have put in that makes the world feel more alive. Sorry, I'm all over the show today. You know what? After this, I might go and poke around a bank. Oops. I just had a moment. Oh, Tom Cleese! Yo. Oh. Oh, oh, Digital Associates. Well, if you were an uplink agent, like I suspect you might be, um, again, there's like maybe 120 people in the game and 60-something of them are uplink agents, so mathematically it's... Grade 13. Fraternising with the N. I have no idea why it keeps locking up like that. Well, it's not a complete freeze or crash because the music keeps playing and mm, how beautiful is that music. It's a great game. I, I do so love it. Okay. Go speed racer. Um, so it's... A day ago. It, yeah, about one day, six hours ago is what I'm going to be looking at. Um, I find it hilarious that... Just drop my pen. Um, I find it hilarious that I've literally made eight, made $800,000 in a day. Also, this is not running as efficiently as it can, but look how quick it is. Yeah. They can't disable the proxy. It's been say it's been disallowed by the proxy. Okay. Of course, the other problem is because I'm routing. Six six dot two two zero dot one two six dot five one. Yeah, so if I ever have to do one of these IP crawls because I'm routing through so many systems, I'm like, uh Was this me? This might be me. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I need to find out if I'm actually backtracing myself. Um, 
66.220.126.51 Bridge software Bridge software Just Fuck off and disconnect Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. Okay, so so this mysterious hacker I'm looking for is actually myself. I'd love that. Two five zero dot one eight zero dot nine five dot two three. Le gagnon, le gagnon. Oh, we are French. I did not know that that was how you access that. That makes so much sense. And of course, as is the way of my people, at first I'm going to figure out who he wired the money to, and then I'm going to steal all of his money for myself. Uh, you know, Australia is a nation founded by convicts. I just got to keep my ancestors proud. Nope, it's not an uplink agent. Two, two, three, dot, three, dot, five, zero, dot, two, three, six. Bank account number two, four, two, nine, zero, eight, six. Four thousand six hundred and eighty-one. Transfer money. One. Nine six dot seven eight dot one zero three dot one two seven four eight seven five four nine uh shit four three eight one oops seven Four eight seven five four nine three hundred. Your statement. the passwords for these bank accounts will change. What am I doing? Transfer money. Two, five, two, dot, one, four, four, dot, five, four, dot, one, zero, one, five, two, nine, three, four, two, for the sum total of three, six, one. I can crash a bank. That, 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 that'll be my final task, will be crash a bank. Mm, all of my money. <laughs> and... Right. So... Uh, choo -choo. So it's that one. Whichever the fuck that one is. Why well, just wait till I get um, my top of the line gear? You guys, you guys will be shocked by how quick all this goes. 
you really do need all the best, like, the fastest rig, the best connection in the fucking game, though. Ah, uh, for the final missions. It's... I actually don't ever think I won the good campaign. I think it was always a bit too much for me. Mandate, I love how I stole nearly a third of what, two-thirds of what has been promised to me. Actually, over two-thirds of what has been promised to me. Just from hacking into the guy's account. The only thing that, that these bank hacking missions are good for is they give you the account number. Because then you can hop into the account number and basically start playing silly buggers in the bank. Because here's the thing. If I, if I had have written down every IP address and every account in Tom Cleese's connection. I basically could have just hopped between all of them and robbed them all blind. So, Universal Tech International Bank. Manage existing accounts, disable the proxy. So it was 2429086. To be fair, if you are transferring $900,000 to another bank account... It's, so actually, this is, this, is, this is an important point. What they actually do in real life is let's just say they want to transfer that 900000 It would be broken up into... like... 2 million tiny transfers of money. Mission complete. So nine zero five four nine two nine zero five four nine zero. Now I'm not actually sure if falsifying the transfer record and saying, oh, hey, I transferred it back to this account. It would actually work. Transfer money. 223.3.50.236. Um, but I'm honestly not willing to try it unless I'm basically sock puppeting an account. Ah. You guys probably all saw what I did there. Transfer was completed successfully. Oh my. Oh my. Eight. One dot eight. Nine dot one zero three dot one two three zero five one two three three. Yeah, so once you have that first bank account number, you can by and large just Follow the paper trail. It's that easy. No mandate. Transfer money. Five two dot one four four dot five four dot one zero one. Five two nine three four two nine zero five four nine two. Transfer is complete successfully. Erase. Erase. Um, <clears throat> oh. <laughs> yeah, sure, okay. <laughs> oh, fucking hell.
fuck me, that's funny. Admin. Huh. Oh no, I have that bank. I have all the banks. But yeah, look at that. I have 1.5 million from four bank hacks. Three bank hacks, technically, because one of them was transferred to the same bank. I'm about to have an extra 900,000 more. So, yeah. Lord Plink. And again, I know I said that you guys would get eventually get sick of seeing me do this, but this is how you keep safe. This is what keeps your fat out of that fire. Congratulations. Ah, <laughs> I'm trying to open the status screen, but I already have it open. Grade 14, bitches. Right. I don't think... I'm, mm, I... I know if you hack into the Uplink internal services system, they get pissy. I, it's probably the same if you hack into the Uplink bank. But yeah, I also jumped up, yeah, like s nine ranks or something just by hacking banks. By hacking three banks. So. God damn it. Now, our bank of 8-1 is... Simcorp. Connect. Three, zero, five, one, two, three, three. That was horribly awkward. Please, you saw nothing. It was Universal Tech. Manage. It was Kaide. Few statements. Son of a bitch. Seven, 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 six, three, seven, seven. So you guys will probably catch that fairly often is that I will misread something because I am the stupid. Now, I, another thing I wonder, and again, don't want to test it, but what I just did there, because technically my hack followed the exact same route, but it ended up at a different point, right? But if the people who are tracing the... F but if I deleted the second hack's lock, but not the first hack's lock, would the people from the second hack then use that evidence to extrapolate, even though it's not the, the hack they're tracing... You know, is, is the machine smart enough to go, wait a minute, seven, 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 six, three, seven, seven. Again, it's, it's a stupid question. It has no real meaning, but it's one I'm genuinely curious for an answer for. Can the machine tracing hack A, but you've deleted the end result for hack A, use the end log from hack B to get you in trouble. Oh, god damn it. With all of this crime and looking over at my copies of Persona 5, I already know that my next character is going to be called Nasty Crime Boy. God damn it. Oh, it's almost the end of the episode. And I've only made ludicrous amounts of money. Do do view account. Renz Stubbs. That sounds like the name of someone in a fucking Warhammer game. Loans. One zero zero three one zero one. Transfer money. Two eight one dot. 9.71.210 I 
account number 8826883. That's uh, so. An another point. Ooh, Ren Stubbs is an uplink agent. How fascinating. Um. God, these people are going to be pissed when they need to use their illegal crime money. And they're like, but, but where is our crime money? And I'm like, haha, fuck you, that's where. Transfer money. Now, I, I don't know how realistic this this spank hacking is but i'd i'd hazard it's son of a bitch two and a half million four banks two and a half million missions are for bitches um no like i was saying it's it's <laughs> would the banks have a server that is right only as if to say uh, information can only be put onto it but can't be removed from it uh, by external connections. How would banks avoid literally what I'm doing here, where if you destroy the, the transfer logs, how can you track when the money's gone? Anyway, as was promised, in the time of our forebears, New gateway. Sign out. Du -du 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 -du. Let us see the mandate. Welcome back. Huh? That's weird. Probably something in the emails that I just blatantly ripped through. Ah, there we go. Just manage a gateway. 400 goddamn gigahertz. Actually, a few gateway. <sighs> so, eight more CPUs and 10 more hunters. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Son of a bitch. Forgot to delete this log. You guys know how I feel about leaving logs behind. Oh yeah, also holy shit how quickly that went. I didn't even notice. Look at how quickly that's going with 400 gigahertz. Basically the only thing that's slowing me down right now is my internet connection. Eight gigaquad per second modem. Right, so that's one, that's two, three, that's four. So one, one, one. And just for the hell of it, I'll never use them, but these ones as well. So how much space do I have? 26 gigs. Oops, didn't mean to click that.
I mean, I'd love to frame a man for bank fraud, but I'm a little busy right now. That's basically everything I'll ever need. Uh, I'll get the land stuff later when it becomes necessary. Here we go. Right. I was only going to do one episode today, but next time, I think I'll do it. I think I'll go after Uplink. Well, remember everyone, I've been Ostentatiousness, you've all still been you, and I will see you in a minute.